It's been a month since a series of accidents shuttered the only toxic waste repository for nuclear bomb building facilities in the U.S. But the operator of the troubled dump says it found the waste a temporary home in rural West Texas. The waste isolation pilot plant near Carlsbad, New Mexico, disposes of waste from Los Alamos National Laboratory. It's been shuttered for over a month following two separate accidents, an underground truck fire and a radiation leak. The letter happened on February 14th and affected 17 of its workers. Now, the Nuclear Waste Partnership says it is proposing to ship the nuclear waste over the border to a site in Andrews County, Texas, until the New Mexico plant reopens. The Texas facility has agreed until the investigations into the accidents are completed. Federal officials released their report on the first accident last week. It says the underground fire was preventable and points to poor maintenance and emergency planning at the facility. Carlsbad residents, in the meantime, continue to wait for the results of an investigation into the second accident, the radiation leak. There were reports of elevated radiation readings in the area just last week. Local officials say the radiation was not related to the February leak and is not a public health threat. The final report on the leak is expected in the next few weeks.